good good morning good morning good morning good morning my subscribers and my newcomers blessing blessing to a new day yes it's a new day that the lord has made we will rejoice and be glad in it thank you lord for this day guide protect us provide and we gratefully thank you in jesus name amen yes my wonderful people how are you doing this morning it's a beautiful day here in fort lauderdale as you can see i'm taking my morning walk as usual mm -hmm. yeah taking my morning exercise it's very important right yes so it's good if we can get up sometimes and take a walk mm-hmm good for your body your health right okay all right love the people there it's a beautiful beautiful view yeah it's a beautiful morning yeah i just came in from work yeah just had something and then decided that i'm going for a walk but i think i probably reach sawgrass mall Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go get me something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so lovely people. Oh, look at our Christmas tree. Look at our Christmas tree in Lauder Hill. Yeah, isn't it beautiful? Let me see if I can zoom up on it. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, there's the tree. Isn't it beautiful? Ah, beautiful. Mm -hmm. I should take a picture of it, but next time. Yeah, I see the building decorated too. Yes. Uh, yeah. Wow, look at this is a new one going off. Wow, God, oh Jesus. New one going off. Hmm. Wow. Okay. Okay, okay. So how are you people doing? All right, I have story to give you. With me and Auntie Donna. Remember Auntie Donna? She named me Buck and Billy. She said Buck and Billy right, but anyway, Buck and Billy Cutlass. Whichever. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so a couple days ago I was on the live. So her her um tribe took me on. Yeah. And um she said I was to call her, so I didn't get to call her then. Okay. I didn't get to call her. So yesterday I yesterday was Thursday. Yesterday was Friday, mm -hmm. the night. So I called her in the afternoon. I realized she was on live. I called her. And of course, we started out real pleasant as usual. Yeah, real pleasant as usual. And then, you know, she loved drama. So she had to create drama. Yes, yes, then I say, you love drama. Baga baga, you love drama. Mm hmm. Yeah. So you had to create drama. So when I told you to tell your alligators and your crocodiles and your snakes to leave me alone, you say you have no control over that. But of course you can have control over that. Others do, so why can't you? You just tell them you don't want that bugger bugger on your on your program. Mm-hmm. And to respect people and respect your donors. Because whether or not you like it, I am a donor, and you have to respect that. That way, you respect any other donor, right? Yeah, I work hard for my money like anybody else. Mm hmm. 
I didn't have to give to your charity, but this spirit lead me to give to your charity because I haven't given to any other charity. Spirit don't lead me to get to know other charity. Mm -hmm. So I give to you. So don't bother come and bright up yourself with me because not because you may be bad man back in the days and you're still bad man, but your your um cover putting a covering over that. Yeah, yeah, I said it. Mm -hmm. Because you said it. You say you never, you never back up on our body. How bad you were. Like you want the world to be bad. Be afraid of you. Mm -hmm. So, I'm not afraid of you. I tell you my opinion. I tell you what I have to say. Yes, bugger bugger, I do. So, you're telling me that. Oh. Yeah, I have file on you. So, I'm to behave myself. I don't care for what I said. You don't have a file for me. The only person who has a file for me Dana, is the US. Mm -hmm. They have a big file on me. You don't have no file on me, Donna. I'm mean, never a thief. I'm mean, never kill nobody for you. So you don't have a file on me. I'm, if me thief, I mean kill anybody, I wouldn't be in the US. Okay, I want to remember that. So don't talk about you have a file on me. Sure, you could them have a file on you. 360 have a file on you. Yeah, landlord. Uh, landlord, I filed by you, yes. Uh -huh. But they are all hypocrites. Uh, tea lady, I filed by you. Uh, hey lady, I filed by you. All of them I filed by you. Yeah, none of them are filed by me. I mean, them are a friend or come below. Mm -hmm. But you and them are come below. So. Yeah, I hope just like how people can record me and send you. I hope them send this to you too. Mm hmm. Yes, so you reach a point now where you say, Oh, you have filed on me because you have record of me talking, um, talking, chatting your cake, bought a cake, them are too expensive. Yet I said to you, Okay, Who's, who said that? You don't know, you don't know who said it. But it was said and you hear it and you know it's my voice and i said play it play it let the whole world hear donna let the whole world hear because we're we're on the internet we're on the live the whole world is listening so prove me wrong prove me wrong or prove that i am a but i'm billy cutlass as i said that is the case why you call me that so prove it yeah and even if i said your cake was expensive of course it is expensive and everybody can buy a cake. Huh? And everybody can buy a cake. It is expensive. But of course we all know why it is expensive, which I said the cake is uh, um, the cakes are expensive because you use um expensive ingredients in them. So you couldn't buy expensive ingredients and sell a cake cheap. That would make no sense, absolute no sense. Right? And saying that I criticize a cake about the price. Why would I criticize a cake and then I still end up buying how much cakes from you? Over 30 cakes. Oh, why would I buy so much cake? And if we did one, if we did one of them who want me to cake and thing, why would I buy 30 cake? All I need is one cake. Huh? I don't have that dirty man. But yeah, you're dealing with people with dirty man. Me not have that dirty man. I'm gonna say why would I buy your cake to mess up, mess you up. Oh, I need to cross the road again. Oh, this van is higher than me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna cross the road again. It's pure sun on this side. There is the falls. Yeah, that's the falls. People will know what this is. We live in here, will know which falls is that. Yeah. Yes, then. You're trying to eat something on the program. When I call you, when I call and I say, no, you're trying to insult me, embarrass me, right? Yeah. Yeah, you're trying to cross the road. Crossing the road. What an awful thing. It's a bright, bright 
day bright and sunny day yes so why would i want to buy your cake right honey what am i saying if you can't prove if you can't prove it then if you can we can't hear the voice note you think me a cloud it can't hear the voice note then it's a lie so not tell a lie for me prove yourself wrong if i said it donna prove me prove me prove that it's a lie prove that whoever you're keeping secret for i thought it didn't take I, I thought it didn't take up gossip you love gossip you love you love gossip you love gossip too much and you love care go bring come here's too much yes i said it because yes eh, me for car me should have called you before me what 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 should i call you about what should i call you about if the cake is expensive how that one buy them to sell right right and as i said i just buy the cake because i wanted to prove to your enemies them that the cake can reach america because they were saying the cake can reach america of course you had other people people selling your cakes so of course how would they have a cake if they didn't come up so it's obviously a cake so that was a stupid statement they're making the cake can't they never stop a cake from coming to america right and that's why i said let me buy and prove them wrong right and then it so happened i had it people start to get food cakes and i told you on the line i had cakes selling and people really called and then that's why i refilled the orders right then my telling you you asking me why did i sell the cake i told you why so you said if i didn't sell them to make money and i said no and i sell the cake to make money and that pissed you off how could that piss you off donald why that i go upset you for your hand your cake after the after the cake then come out of your hand and your cake again you know so you can tell me upset if me buy the cake i'm gonna buy or me now buy cake for, for make money you know, me, me have a job Dana. as i said to you i have a job i am employed for the past um eight years i'm at this job right yep so and i'm living and if i need more money if i need a little more money on my salary i do some overtime yes simple mm -hmm. so i'm gonna need to sell your cake then to make for survive yeah i mean should have followed my husband to me say what may i sell cake for why am i selling cakes i'm equal i'm telling you if me alone yeah, we should have just follow him or else we will be where we are right now right yeah yes lovely people that's how done operate and then she go on in a one tantrum go on in a one tantrum she don't want to buy sell her cake because some people take her cake and them go go do what they want with her cake and take off labels and all of that Donna I am not that sort of person I have absolutely no time to play games right I don't know why I should be doing that. Matter of fact, when we're sending money for, for um, charity, why you didn't have a negative opinion? Why you didn't go and operate the way you, you're operating now? Huh? Because in time, they still, still have to uh, uh, express my views, you know. And nobody didn't you know, see it, you know, you see it. But you see it when I express my views now. Mm hmm. But then they should tell me, you know what, my money for your charity. Yes, your charity, you thought about. I say your charity like you'll get the money. It's your charity. Whose charity is it? And your charity. Hey, now you come up with your charity. And you come up with this on your charity. Say so you yes, say we don't contribute to you. Alright, me not contribute to you, but we contribute to your cake. Yeah. I contributed to your cake. So I contributed to you. And you should appreciate that. I don't argue with you. And don't want to say about you because I'm one of your customers. I don't want to use a quarter. Right? So you should not come argue with me. You don't come try to embarrass me. You're worse than Anna. Oh, Anna, do not kill it. Yeah, you're worse. When you come on and I come try to insult me, embarrass me. 
in, in front of the world because it's the whole world listening to you you have a big audience all right so and then after but if i said your cake is expensive all i said i remember as i said one lady called me from new york just as we start selling a cake and incidentally her name janet she could be lying and i feel that's the woman because when she called the first thing she start was talking about donald's cake how it's expensive and i said to myself hmm this sound like a trap i'm not gonna say nothing so all i said to her okay i think i think i said to her well if they're expensive then um you'll have to buy the cake somewhere else or something like that towards it i said but i didn't i didn't entertain that conversation and i have my friend as a witness who she said yes janet i remember when you told me about that situation and you thought it was a trap yeah so i think that's the lady and the other lady who said um the cakes were expensive i think it's a lady from nothing a lady from atlanta so when she went to pick up the cake from my daughter she had a conversation and my daughter i don't so i don't know if that conversation was with my daughter because my daughter voice gets so like mine you know so she the, she was saying oh the cake expensive so i don't know if she and my daughter hold a conversation and she take tape at the same time and then send it go say i me. right but i don't know me anybody and i don't see I don't see the logic in buying your cakes and then complaining and then complaining to the I don't hold no conversation with nobody who who were customers they just come matter of fact none of them pay me money before they get the cake not one of them can say them them, them and my money out of my pocket me buy the cakes send it to Carlos Carlos or him name and him send Tat's husband and him it before it was Claudia who used to deal with it for me until she, she left and then um Tad's husband took care of it for me and I get them on time and intact everything was fine we had absolutely no problem so I don't know where all this problem and animosity coming up from now right I'm gonna sell the kid and me all the problem I had is one woman who she could be, would be the one to who send tape because she tell me she said she have tape of me and then I start for my money she called me in January which I had no intention of buying cakes I said to her if I get at least four or five people one cake I'll order the cakes I get them other people I get them other people I ordered the cakes she ordered two not one but two okay the cakes came within no time i called her said the cakes are here she said she have no time to come and pick them up and i said okay i'll deliver them for you right so call and tell them coming with the cakes she told me she would be home yeah said she would be home and i said okay i'll come in the afternoon and she said okay come and if you call and don't hear me i'll be at the back on my way i called the lady to let her know i'm coming the woman telling me oh i'm not at home so I said, so what do I do now? Because I use a taxi, I take to come here. She said, so I said, nobody's at home. She said, somebody's there working. Can't leave it with him. And I honestly left the cakes with the man. And I said, okay, you can bring the money when you have the time. And up to today's date, from January till now, people, she woman can pay me $150, which includes taxi because twice i went there to pick up the money and i told her and she don't live far from me and i told her to bring the money to me she find all the excuses. when i was in jamaica i said okay send the money to me in jamaica I, she said oh you have a jamaica national I said yes my sister-in-law has jamaica national you can send it to her gave her the number hmm. i came back no money mm -hmm. till to the date she tell me it's becoming too miserable why I'm gonna get my money or it's gonna get a long time with her face to self. So that's a whole then she say I went to her house, you know. One morning from work I went, went straight to the taxi when they're straight. Her son came out, said she was not there. Mm -hmm. Then not long after, 
one of our tenants came out to ask if she's there and he said yes she is gonna call her why would he say he's gonna call her if she wasn't there hmm? why would he come back out and say she said she's not there she said it here and she said she's not there <laughs> yeah and then when we call her you now she'll tell me oh my son did tell her to come back for the money he didn't come back which is a lie mm -hmm. and up to today day and you know where i am and you don't call me and say okay miss janet or janet i am my conscience because she even called me and i said during the time she said okay i'm gonna come and buy another cake because my husband liked the cake the cakes so she said if i have any more of the fruit i think it was and i said yes so me, me said, okay come and you get the fruit and i'll um, give you an extra one an additional one which i meant it and she don't turn up because she knows she ain't gonna pay me for the two or she oh mm -hmm. that's how kind that was about to deal with this woman named jackie from lord of the lakes thief mm -hmm. that's the only one that she let me know she 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 have me on voice note so i don't know if she's the one who sent about cake expensive or whatever right because after i buy the cakes buy the cakes and bring from jamaica shipping is expensive i have to pay carlos right and then when i come i have to put on my little markup on it yeah so 65 dollars or 80 dollars depends on the size cake or maybe 100 and maybe 10 or so depends for those cake which are maybe five thousand dollar cake or something like that you know and i had no problem so why would i have a problem donna saying okay cake is expensive eh? i want to buy them i want to buy them okay so don't come and embarrass me and something about your cakes coming now in a cake war me and a tina chin me and a tina chin me and a no cake war with you all right i mean no cake war with you so don't come tell me about no cake yeah that's how you that's how your bread and butter make a cake sell a cake me can't cake me don't like baking yeah I don't like bacon, I don't like sweets because I'm not too much sweets. I'm a diabetic. Mm -hmm. And I did say I didn't like it. Sorry, okay. Yeah. I mean, I know I said I don't like this. It's another one that's actually not like it either. But, and then last year, this year was supposed to be tasting better than last year. Yeah. I didn't like it, so if me tell us, I'm going to like it, you have eggs with me. Yeah. Let me tell you the truth, which I said on my, my video, that others may like it. Everybody have different tastes. I didn't put, I didn't taste coconut. Because I, I had coconut, but I couldn't be cutting up all the cakes just to taste. You know, I sell myself. I can make back my money. At least my money when I, when I spend. Right? Even right now, because I did plan to sell cakes again because up to this point I still haven't collected no money that I may sold the cake for in Atlanta I told my daughter keep the money and next year I'm going to buy cakes to sell yeah and the time come now so it's not that I didn't plan again to sell the cakes right but it's with her um, conversation and argument yesterday I'm out of it I, I, don't, I don't want your cake don't want your cake at all at all at all i'm walking away with a long stick yeah walking away because you look and face yourself with me and that's my co-worker they said to me say and you don't know you don't answer that i don't know in you mm -hmm. i don't know how you don't answer donna you may not get to like you donna but i can surely answer you yeah and i yell and face your ring and you have one face in our rank, you know, Donna. I'm going to have to tell you no bad word. Come in a bad word, don't grow up in a bad word. I can't tell you. Answer you. Just like how you can cuss. Mm -hmm. We don't have to be disrespectful. We don't have to reach there. Yeah. You don't have to reach there. Yeah. So I just say go with me and she people. 
all the time you end up in an argument all the time for a long time you're done in an argument you know you know this argument start like two three years ago i remember there was a Saturday. You know it's Friday. It's Saturday. Yeah. Yes, so um Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is my usual walk in the morning. My usual walk. Yeah, so Don and I we got arguing. How about 20 2020 yeah the time that she didn't rank you know i mean the time that she not listen to nobody and she talk she she just chat blah 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 when you talk she just chat over you she not listen you know mm -hmm. the time that she not hatch you know man both of you put on makeup yeah yes donna yeah donna you don't you know, look nothing like the makeover like you want it to look like lisa and a yeah you want to look like lisa anna but you're not gonna look like lisa anna. <laughs> you can only have it in a dream yes donna yeah yeah so you there was a lady named janet and um she was from canada and she used to be honey she used to provoke donna she was the one anybody who won here now used to watch Donna from the beginning you know, who I'm talking because she used to wear the um, fireman hat and whenever she make her comment they would say it's me yeah they would say they would they would say this Janet and some people would say no that's not the Janet we're talking about that's not the Janet until eventually I don't know what happened and then I think she was blocked or something like that then I think I saw her her over lady be on one of that page. Yeah. But she was going on bad. So and from that day till now, whenever I say anything, them take me on. Yeah. And then when I say anything, some of my mind speak my mind and tell that Donna is upset. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then she said, no, me I'll go, me left the shop, me left the the shop and gone somewhere else i didn't go nowhere else i was still there but me in the back i watch and i listen but me just now go up front yeah because me know my finger jiggy so i rather watch the dead so the dead them usually watch mm -hmm. so i think i still watch the, the dead because but right now me still have a back on our page and my chef tell me have to tell me um or play that voice note mm -hmm. i mean i'm insisting she play that voice note because i want you to prove me guilty prove me guilty yeah what is there to hide i'm not a body man with a rip so i'm not actually probably husband so i don't know we have to show we have to hide yeah so play it Mm-hmm. I don't know me I don't know me I me have to hide, I don't know a man in a bed. A cheap on my husband and you have the voice note or sex tape. Yeah? So play it Donna. That's all I ask if you play it. Yep. And I say we have to watch it. Yeah, we have to watch you. Are you the you're the now we have to watch you. Yeah. We have to watch it, but we don't have to tolerate your foolishness at times. Yeah. We don't have to tolerate your foolishness. Yeah, and not everybody worship you. I mean, I worship you. Yeah. I won't. And so, uh, when name Dwayne used to worship you, look at him now. Dwayne was one of them who always cuss out the people, them fear, you know. Yeah. The, Dewin was a regular contributor from England, yeah. 
help Saloni. Very kind, kind to Saloni. Yeah. But look like he did infatuated with Donna. Okay, you couldn't say no do nothing wrong for Donna to him. Mm -hmm. I want to say anything in take you on and post you the most way. Yeah, he was one of them. Mm -hmm. He was one of them. I saw the people then. Yeah. I know him and Donna hip off. But that's how you go. That's how you go. But Donna you need to respect people and their opinion. Not everybody gonna like you. Not everybody gonna hate you. Right? Not everybody gonna like you, not everybody gonna, everybody gonna hate you. God give you a talent, God bless you, and that is your talent to be. Not everybody give a talent to do. I mean, talk about me a baker, I don't know about baking. I don't have the, I don't have the, if you talk about cooking, I have a passion. I can cook, I have absolutely no problem with cooking. Mm -hmm. But baking is not me. I'd rather go buy the cake. Yeah. I'd rather go buy the cake. Yes. Yeah. So, love the people. That's what it is with me and Donna. Yeah. All right. I'm going to put it here because when it's too long, nobody's going to sit and listen. It's a long while. So, back and belly cutlass family. <laughs> Those who like the name. Mm -hmm. Have yourself a nice day. Lord bless and keep you. Love and peace. Remember to subscribe, like, and share, and thumbs up whenever I have or whenever there is new videos. Okay? Bye bye.